All right. All right, Master Shredder, talk to the people, man. Let them know what's getting ready to go down. What's good, gangsters? We back again with another banger for y'all. Today, we're going to give y'all a back workout using the bar, your own body weight, calisthenics, no weights. You want to build your back and you just want to use the bar, we're going to show you some ways today how to get that done. So we're going to start on the pull-up bar first. All right, I see the merch yeah, right there see coming the merch soon. Coming, train different, gain different. Master okay. Shredder, this is one of many waves for y'all, big waves okay. for y'all. All right. All right. Show y'all what's going on. You know what he's talking about when it comes down to the yeah, back yeah, workouts. Yeah, yeah. Definitely, definitely, man. That's when you know, like, especially in calisthenics, that you know your workouts is 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 paying off. Yeah. When the back gains. All right. All right. So the bar, we're gonna use the bar to right for these couple exercises. I'm gonna show you guys. Oh, oh nice catch. draft today show you guys on the bar so I like to hit different angles train different gain different if the back is a big has a bunch of different muscle groups in it from top to mid to lower so we're gonna start like more on the top right now so we're gonna do some arches right now on the bar this is more for if you got good time on the bar you're good on the bar pull-ups for more so people that's better on the bar so So, not only I, that, why I like that is because it's a dynamic workout. What, what we mean by dynamic is we're doing a lot of different combinations of muscle groups and movements at one time. So we're getting a lot of core, hip, um, and of course the back, what we're working on, biceps, everything, getting that lower back. That's what we want. Not lower back, upper back, sorry. Getting the upper back. I'm going to show you what, how we get them lower back abs too. We want that you don't know how my back, this is how you get it. Now we're gonna do some more side to side, kissing the hand, see what's going on here. One more, make sure you control it. Yeah, that felt good on the top of our back too. Um, opening up our chest too, controlling the whole time through. Even in the bodybuilding and weightlifting arena, they'll tell you it's better to control those reps if you really wanna grow the muscle. You wanna control it with the muscle, slow, controlled and properly, right? I'm not saying that fast tempo ain't good, but if you only do on fast tempo, then you, you're gonna get too comfortable and you're not gonna really grow right. Okay. And for the lower back. All right, talk about this one. What you got for the lower back? For the lower back, what I got for y'all, you might say, oh, you never knew that. But this one right here, doing some levers, front levers. Uh, this is a front lever, right? That's what you call it. Now, this right here, for me to really get my body in the position that I need, I have to, it has to come from down here and, and start from this area right here, that lower back area. That's, that's a major part of your core and it even going into your legs as well. So um, that's why I like doing these to hit the lower back like very effectively and efficiently, all right?
Oh, see, you're gonna hear, you're gonna see some people in the comments. They might not agree with that. That um, that's not working the uh, the low back. So uh, might, we'll, they see. Might say, we'll see. They might say that. So what do you say to them? That's not, that's a core exercise, not low well, back. Well, like I said, your lower back is a part of your core. Right. So, okay. Yep. Okay. Yeah. So. All right. When you do a lot of core exercises, even I'm gonna show you. Okay. I'm gonna get back to that one. Okay, with the right uh, back, with the lower back. Okay. Let me show you another one though. Nice. Right, so. On the back, on the bar, because. Okay. Pause that, hold that thought right there. Okay. Show you one, this last one on the bar for the lower back and then we're gonna get back. Not for the lower back, for the back period on the bar. And like I said, it's a dynamic. I like to do dynamic movements, train different, gain different. Right. So rather than just focusing on one part, the, lot of the, the, the harder exercise actually focus on many different groups at the same time. You have to concentrate much more. So once you have to concentrate more, that just makes it that much harder. You know, once you have to use your brain, like when you could just, you know, <laughs> flow off it, you know, that, that's easy. Once you have to think and actually function and do at the same time, that's, that's hard. It might sound like, you know, <laughs> like, what do you mean? You aren't you always doing and thinking at the same time, but you know, a lot of people be on autopilot, so. All right, so this close grip right here, Okay, that's another move, controversial move. People might not agree with that that's hitting your uh, back. Well, you would explain that to them. Yeah, I mean, first of all, everybody feels like they're an expert, right. which is not the case. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's not an expert. Like you said, let the gangs do the talk. Yeah, let you the gangs the... speak. <laughs> speak to the gangs. All right, speak to the gangs, all right? All right, so, I mean, just from that set alone, I feel like my lats and, you know, even my, like the back of my arms. So yeah, back, tricep. you heard that, you heard the name, you heard that word back. So right. even the back of my arms is getting hit too, not just the right. back of right. my body. So That's right. it's a lot more than just the back getting hit right there. That's right. And anytime you, any type of pull up you're doing, you're hitting the back. Yeah. <laughs> so that's like, that's, a fact. that's when, so, so somebody who would say that, I already could decipher like, okay, this is a bow's ear who doesn't mm -hmm. know what the hell they're talking about. <laughs> that's right. It's and the back back yeah. of the shoulders. Yeah, 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 yeah. A little yeah, bit of training yeah. thing back that's yeah. behind, you know, on the pull-up. Yeah, exactly. So right. it's kind of like, like I said before, like if you are a gym guy or, you know, you like to go to the gym and do Cali's, when you do hit like the um, the rows and you change the grip, you hit the, you, you, you do some close, they have like a close grip one, you know, where you could either pull mid or pull down you have the right. wide grip mm -hmm. you have all type of grips so right yeah and go. so back to the back to the um low back yeah the lever when they said that um the levers is not really going to be working lower back yeah that's that's false because why because when you work in your core you're hitting you're not you when you work in your core that's the difference between doing core workouts and just doing sit-ups like regular sit-ups regular sit-ups is not really hitting the core it's hitting like the um you know the surface abs and shit like the core workouts now is hitting the lower abs so if you do have trouble with lower abs growing you have to do more core workouts because it's hitting the lower abs and to really hit the lower abs that lower back has to start pulling so it's like it's like front to back like yin and yang you see it's a science so what i mean by that when you work in your core, if you pay attention on, on the bench, if my lower back is up like this, you see on the bottom right there, if my lower back is up and I'm working, I'm not really activating my core. So you see now I suck my back to the bench, my lower back, now my core is activated the whole time. Now it's being activated when I when I suck my, when my lower back is sucked to the bench. Right. So that's why that's like, uh, just 
somebody talking out their ass when they say, or just people who want to talk, like, you know, they got a lot of these guys. Yeah, people attention. that just have an opinion. Yeah, yeah, so let's finish up, man. Just wanted to clarify and, and make sure y'all get the right game because we got a lot of, you know. A lot of trolls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so now on the bar, we're going to do some, on the dip bar, we're going to finish off. So you see me do the arches on the lower, on, on this bar too. So with the neutral grip, you could actually also do it too. Now you isolate it more when you do these type of workouts, these arches and one-handed workouts. So hold it just a bit. Getting good biceps on those too. If you want to try to hit the biceps a different way, but you're hitting the back as well to isolate it. When I hit those, when I hit that move right there, that's what's going on. You want to pull your elbows and make sure your elbows pull through all the way through your body. And another good one is these pull-ups like behind the neck. You could do these on the bar, bar like dip bar, or if you have like Olympic rings, TRX, these work with that too. The form is what matters first. You want to have the legs straight out. said again if you can't get to the pull-up bar to get into the dip bar you can do a lot of these things too and yeah that's that's gonna hit our low that's gonna hit our back our, our upper back I'm this side back. Sure that on there. let me see get a better look you get the light on you yeah that's gonna that's gonna um there you go good exercises there yeah good get exercises man I say three to five sets Depending on how much time you got, you can hit 10 cents. If you really want to yeah. test your <laughs> might. For <laughs> the advance, really for the advance. It, Yeah, for the advance. Yeah. Like, and really been doing it for a while and trying to seek that challenge and push to new levels. <laughs> this right here, hit that 10 sets, five sets for, you know, people who's not quite advanced, but they trying to get there. And then, you know, about three sets for like the beginners is good trying to get there and yeah that's that's our back work for today okay and hope y'all stay in loop stay in tune and keep supporting shirt sure. yep got the got the merch coming for y'all train different game different master shredder feeling powered when you put that on man yeah all right good looking out shredder links to shredder's youtube page and it's the YouTube page will be in the yep. description box. Um, links to his uh, 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 Gmail him for the meal plans. Yeah, you want the, the meal um, plans. You want the, the merchandise. Um, training. Consultations, yeah. online training. Right. Any type of services you're looking for dealing with health, wellness, fitness, and mental. Yeah, holla at me. All right, good looking out. For more to come from Shredder, man. Really, though. All right.